Hi, so today I'm going to talk about um, motivation or uh, more specifically lack of motivation, which I am really feeling today. And I honestly didn't feel like doing these videos, but you know, I committed in my mind to trying to do this at least once a week, so I decided to go ahead and do it. And I figured since I was feeling so unmotivated, that's something I could talk about. Um, I'm not sure if difficulty in getting myself motivated comes from Asperger's syndrome or if it's just my personality or if it maybe is triggered somewhat by depression because I do have problems with anxiety and depression as well. But I'm kind of an odd person because sometimes I can be extremely focused, ambitious, driven, like I can be, you know, just churning out the artwork, you know, painting all the time, drawing all the time, writing all the time, publishing books, doing events, um, doing interviews, I mean, all that kind of stuff. I can, sometimes I'm really, really into it, and sometimes I kind of shock myself at how much I actually get done in such a short time. But then there's other times, like I'm having right now, where I just... I don't feel it. I don't really care. I don't really want to do anything. I I guess if I did want to do anything, it would be like to indulge in my special interests, you know, like watch videos or uh, listen to music or whatever, you know, whatever my special interest currently is. Because I could literally, if I allowed myself, I could sit, especially when I'm really into a special interest I could sit all day and just do it and like the day would be gone like that so that's just kind of how I'm feeling and I was just wondering you know for others who have Asperger's syndrome do you have this issue I mean do you feel like sometimes you're so motivated and passionate and you know you just you do 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 and you get everything done and you know and then other times like it's hard work to get yourself to shower and get dressed and I know that somewhat it probably is a depression thing um because you know depression comes with the whole lack of motivation desire to do anything you know you tend to just kind of want to sleep or do nothing and I definitely have times like those although times like these don't necessarily feel like depression like when I'm really really depressed I know it and it's different than this. This is just this feeling of, I just don't care. I just don't want to do anything. I mean, it's not really even depression, I don't think, but I don't know. I mean, it could be mild depression, um, which uh, my doctor, she, besides um, the anxiety, um, she gave me some kind of diagnosis. Um, I think it was like this mythic disorder or something like that which is where you're like just consistently mildly depressed and I'm not sure that that's actually a mental illness. I mean, I, I tend to think it's kind of like a personality thing with me. I just tend to be melancholy and kind of low key and I don't know. I just, I think that's somewhat my personality, but maybe it's not, maybe it is, you know, some kind of disorder. I mean, but I don't, I just don't understand a lot of times um, why I struggle so much with getting myself to do things, especially when, you know, there are things I love to do, you know, I love to write, I love to paint, I love to draw, I love all those things, and yet sometimes it's just, it's like pulling teeth to get myself to motivated to do any of it. And I just, I guess I don't understand that. And I mean, I even, I like doing these YouTube videos. And, you know, once I get them done and, you know, I always feel good about it. And, you know, I'm happy to be able to share my feelings with others. And I've had a lot of people say that, you know, the videos have kind of helped them and that they can relate to them, which, you know, is really important to me. That's a big part of the reason that I do anything I do is in the hope that maybe it could help someone else or encourage them or support them or whatever. Because, you know, I know this world isn't all about me, and, you know, I I realize that one day, you know, I'm going to be gone, we're all going to be gone, and I want to leave something positive behind. So that's why 
whether it's my art or my writing or these videos or anything like that, I, I always hope that, you know, I'm affecting people's lives and doing good. And that's what I try to do. I mean, I'm not perfect by any stretch of the imagination and I can be a selfish jerk sometimes, but you know, in my heart, I feel like I really want to do good. And even when I have feelings like today where I just don't care about anything and I don't want to do anything, I mean, I still care about things. Like, I mean, I, I still care about people. I care about the world. So it's not like a real depression state because when I am honestly, seriously depressed, like, I honestly don't care just about anything. I don't care about myself. I don't care about what's going on around me. I don't care about the world. Like... There's times that I've been so severely depressed. I mean, honestly, I don't think I'd have been that upset if, like, the world would have exploded or something, because then it would have been over. But, you know, that's not the feeling I'm having right now. And I just wanted to share and kind of get the impression from others and see if anyone else experiences this kind of thing. And if so, like, what do you think it is? Is it something related to the autism? Is it some kind of depression? Is it just personality? So that's kind of what I wanted to talk about today. Um, and I appreciate you guys watching. I'm sorry this is kind of a downer. I just, I don't know, just not feeling it today. But I appreciate you watching anyway. Thanks.